YouTube launched a new strike policy that helps you. One of the improvements are you now only get a strike for three months instead of six months. That means if you've had a strike for, let's say, four months, it's now instantly gone because three months have expired. Tell us down there in the comments below if you've noticed one of your strikes magically disappearing yesterday. This is documented in the official YouTube help and we will go over all the other changes to the new YouTube strike policy after this. Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Maku and welcome to The George Show. Thank you, Maku. That was level one collaboration with me, George. Click that eye to learn all about the other levels of collaboration where you can get featured on The George Show just like Maku did behind me by leaving a comment with a link to his video. To see Maku's channel, click the link down there in the description below where you'll find a lot of other links like to the YouTube help that we are about to talk about for the new copyright strike rules. In the start are these changes to account standing in the YouTube help. I will zoom out a little bit so we can see the whole article. And previously, YouTube accounts with community strikes, guidelines, and content ID matches would lose access to a set of features. YouTube has now made changes to how this works, so read below for the changes on how these strikes can affect your YouTube account. The key points are, if you get a strike, your live stream access may be disabled for 90 days. If you get three strikes, your channel will be terminated. Note, it's not maybe, it is will be. Deleting videos will not clear your strikes. Do not delete videos that get a strike. If you do, there is nothing you can do to appeal the strike. As long as the video is not deleted, you can appeal the strike and there's a chance that it will go away. Here are the basics. Do not delete a video because it will not resolve the strike, meaning it won't go away. How do you make a strike go away? Well, there's three ways. One, wait for it to expire. As we said, that is now three months instead of six months. Yay! Get a retraction. This is the best way to remove a strike. It's when you contact the person who made the strike, which you will get in the email that is sent when you're notified you got a strike. Contact the person and ask them to retract their copyright claim. Now this retract link goes to a specific page that describes exactly how to do that. Click the link. Again, down there in the description below are all the links to the pages I'm showing you right now. The third way is to submit a counter notification using the YouTube button. If you believe the video was mistakenly removed and you don't want to contact the person who gave you the strike, this will notify the person who gave you the strike that you are disputing it. You'll be able to put in the reason why you think it should be removed and if he agrees, he will remove the strike. Those were copyright strikes. What about community guideline strikes, which are not given for copyright content, but instead for doing things like putting boobs in your thumbnails when your videos are not about boobs. That's called deceptive advertising. Do not stuff tags into your video description. Don't take popular keywords and just put them into your video description in the hopes of getting higher search results. That will get you a community guideline strike, guys. It is bad behavior and do not do it. Many of you are still doing it, thinking I haven't been caught yet, so I'll keep doing it. Well, keep doing it until you're caught and then you will be sorry. Stop now. Use proper thumbnails. Use proper English descriptions in your video description. Look at our description down there beneath this video. Do that again. Deleting your video will not resolve the strike. If you do get a community guideline strike, you can appeal it. Don't delete the video. But before you appeal it, you have to be aware that if your appeal is denied, then you won't be able to appeal future strikes on your account for a period of 60 days. So don't appeal just because you think someone may make a mistake and remove your community guideline strike. If you know you did something bad, don't appeal it. Because then if you didn't do something bad in the future, you won't be able to appeal it for 60 days. If you submit an appeal, what may happen is that they can reinstate your video if they think there is nothing wrong, like your video was false flagged. That can happen. They may remove the strike but keep the video down in some cases. They may reinstate your video behind an age restriction if they feel there is no violation but the content is not appropriate for all ages. 
such as if you're talking about how to make love, obviously that's not going to be appropriate for all ages. And if they find the video did violate community guidelines, they may uphold the strike and keep the video down. Those are the main changes to the new YouTube copyright strike system. Tell us down there in the comments below what you think about these changes. Do you have any other tips to help the Freedom family deal with strikes? Tell us those in the comments below. The spirit of freedom is that we all help each other grow together as a family. So click that eye and partner with Freedom, if you haven't already, to join this beautiful Freedom family. YouTube launched another new way to help you grow, as Michael O. Martin pointed out a few hours ago, and that is right here, the YouTube Creator Hub for all subscriber counts. Click that eye to see the video talking all about this new resource. Be sure to watch it so you can grow faster on YouTube. And we have a new crib. The Freedom Crib is a resource of graphics and video and intros and everything you need to spice up your channel on our Freedom Forums, free for the Freedom family. But you have to have your forum badge. How do you get it? Click that I to learn all about the new Freedom Crib, how to get the forum badge, and get downloading all those amazing assets. We will feature a level four collaboration from someone who spends a lot of time helping you down there in the comments below. You see all these little verified ticks? Those represent people who are part of the community team. And I'm going to feature Kyle today from South Africa who's 18 years old and part of the community team for freedom. Roll it, Kyle. Hey everyone, my name is Kyle Steele, AKA Decrepit Sundu 3. I'm 18 years old and I'm from South Africa. I decided to get into YouTube because I suffer from a condition known as bipolar and I decided that I wanted to get the get it out there and show other people that suffer with this disease that uh, they don't have to be afraid, they don't have to hide it from anyone, they can just uh, be themselves. I like helping people because I like making a difference, I like seeing people happy after I've been able to help them in some way, be it for something small, be it for something big. If I'm able to help them at all and see the end result as them being happy, I feel extremely happy to see that I've been able to make a difference in their lives. A few random facts about me is that I am really good with electronics. I used to play cricket. I graduated top of my class in computer applications, not technology, even fourth in the uh, district. I'm Carl Steele, aka Decrepit Sunday 3, and I'm part of the Freedom Community Team. We are stronger together because we are YouTube. Thank you, Kyle. And who am I? I am George Sunpai, Papa George, Guru George, and many other names you, the beautiful Freedom family, has given me. I am George, CEO and founder of Freedom! Maybe I should get a flowing cape to go along with that epic freedom in the future. For Freedom and the Freedom family! We all have for freedom and the freedom family, where we all help each other grow together. For the freedom community team, for helping all of you down there in the comments below. For the freedom GFX team, for creating all those amazing assets on Freedom Crib and on the Freedom Dashboard at www.freedom.tm, the GFX team page. Check it out if you haven't already. If you like this video, click the like button down there so I know what kind of content you enjoy and subscribe to Freedom Central, which is behind me, where you can see the first Freedom Millionaire. One of you has earned over a million dollars, seriously. Head on over to youtube.com slash freedom, check that out, subscribe to the channel if you like it. It is the home of the George Show. I am George and you've been watching The new YouTube strike police has come to take your channel. No, it hasn't. It's the strike policy. YouTube re The new YouTube strike po will help you grow faster on YouTube. What's that? Yeah, let's do the George show like this.
and we will grow together as a family because this is the freedom family you are part of it we are all part of it and we're all growing together so grow with us and partner with freedom that play now button right there on the video bar is all you need to click to get started